science talk. The life cycle of what? Science is built on predictions. What's yours? What's this? Can you tell what it is now that it's hatched? I'll give you a hint. From this little egg sac, between 200 and 400 babies are born. And they are born hungry. Born white because they'd never seen light. They brown quickly. But hunger is a problem. Barely the size of your pinky nail, the only thing they can catch are little fruit flies, which are about the size of the period at the end of a sentence. They eat two or three a day. When they're young, they're so small that they're actually hunted by ants. I caught this ant trying to pull a baby through the netting. Have you guessed yet what this bug is? Here is a close-up. Teensy weensy. After about a week of eating fruit flies, they're making new friends and bursting out of their skin. So they shed it. It's called molting. They come out a little bit bigger, and now they can eat mosquitoes and flies that are bigger. The skin they leave behind is called their exoskeleton. That means their skeleton is on the outside. Isn't that weird? And take a quick visit with old friends, and then, if they have time, they have lunch. Mm. Born the size of your pinky nail. A month later, they're eating flies that size. A week later, they molt again, get a little bit bigger. And then, if they're lucky, they go on vacation. This one was lucky, Cape Cod lucky. And then they molt again and grow bigger. Then, if they're lucky, they watch football. This one was lucky. She likes the Patriots. Next thing you know, they're big enough to hold the camera. Hey. So, what do you do when you can hold the camera? You take a selfie with old friends. And then they climb on your face. Ah, it tickles. Say cheese or, or bugs. From this on the left, tiny little thing, to this on the right much bigger than a tiny little thing in five months. And then it's time to be set free, to catch their own eggs and lay their own egg sacs, which will bear up to 400 more babies, which will be hungry for fruit flies and mosquitoes and keeping us safe from Triple E and keeping us company. Did you know there are over 2,000 species of praying mantis around the world? They all look different. Ours lives about eight months. Can you guess why? They die in the winter. This one is called an orchid mantis. Where do you think it hides? Mm -hmm. In a flower. A praying mantis has five eyes, two big round ones on the sides, which are there to detect movement, and three in the middle that you can't see for detecting light. This gives a mantis the ability to see three-dimensionally. Praying mantis only eats live prey, but if they can avoid becoming lunch for some ant or bird, they can grow up to about six inches long. Some grow big enough to catch birds. Mantids have sharp barbs on their arms to trap their prey. It's like having a Venus flytrap on your arm to trap your food. Praying mantids have wings, but they can't fly. They use their wings to jump extra far so it looks like they are flying. Thanks for watching.